Welcome to Quick Learning. Today we are going to address a very common question that we daily uh, encounter in our SAP use, which is how to find a list of or, or a data of uh, maintenance orders that have been completed for a specific duration of time, or how to get the data of the maintenance order that are still op open from last two months or three months or four months. To get all this data, the, we can use the transaction IW38. It's a very useful transaction. I will repeat again IW38 that is used to display uh, the list of maintenance orders based upon our requirement or our search criteria. So I will press IW38 and this window will appear in front of you. So. So we will see by uh, looking at each tab what is here. So these are the search criteria what we want to search in to this uh, transaction. First one is order status that is outstanding orders or in process orders or completed historical etc. So if I want to search the completed orders only what I will do I will select the completed orders tab right. So the, now whatever data I will put here related to the function location, equipment, material, etc. Plant work center. So only completed orders will be displayed through this transaction. So I have selected this completed tab because I want to get the data of completed maintenance orders. Next is we should select the period of time. For example, I want to get the detail of the first month of the 2022 that is 31 12 31 1 2022 so i want to get the list of maintenance orders that are completed during this duration of time if i just press execute by entering the uh, you know the the planning plant then for this pla this particular plant all the maintenance orders will be appeared in front of me for example, I write here 3003 that is the planning plant. So for this duration of time, I will press execute and you will see, I hope, the list of maintenance orders that are completed during this duration of time for this uh, plant. So you can see this is the list of orders. All These are all type of orders. These are maintenance orders plus these are orders of the other type as well. So these are completed total 247 orders are there that are completed during this duration of time. So you can see that by just entering one, one search criteria that is 3003 I have searched the list of maintenance orders that are completed. For example I want to be a bit more specific and I want to search by using the function location. I have this function location in my mind. This is the function location of some particular warehouse or some particular production line I will write it here and now I will press execute button and you will see these are the uh, maintenance orders these these 40 or 28 or 30 maintenance orders that were completed during this duration of time so I have complete data these are their date of completions I can you know sort them by, by in descending order on as well so these are the maintenance orders so these are the details work center order type technical completion date etc so just a new window has popped up in front of me I will just close it down so this is the notification against the, which this maintenance order was created and you can see the cost actual cost is also being appeared here if I want to get the total cost that uh, what is the cost that has incurred uh, during for these maintenance orders I, I have this data and I can just you know sum it and I will be able to see the total cost that is incurred so you can see 9.137 million co is cost is incurred uh, through these maintenance orders that are completed in this duration of time so you can see this is a very useful transaction IW38 and I am able to get the list of all the completed maintenance orders for a particular duration of time. If I remove duration, 
it will take a lot of time it will get data of everything in its uh, data bank for this particular function location so it's wise to uh, enter a specific period uh, in this transaction so that you can get just required data so i hope this uh, session would have been very useful for you for any questions you can just write in the transactions tab in the comments tab please like and share this video and subscribe to our channel until next time bye bye